The Marines and sailors of 2nd Marine Aircraft Wing may call the Carolinas home, but their impact is felt around the world. The Marines and sailors prepared and trained around the clock to be ready, capable, and successful as the aviation combat element for 2nd Marine Expeditionary Force. For 80 years, the Wing has participated in major battles and campaigns that defined our nation. 2nd Marine Aircraft Wing has continued to generate, deploy, and sustain expeditionary combat-ready units to support mission requirements, allies, and partners worldwide. Since its activation on July 10, 1941, with squadrons in San Diego and Hawaii, 2nd Marine Aircraft Wing contributed mightily to the successful execution of operations and campaigns in the South Pacific. Relocating to North Carolina in 1946, the Air Wing's presence has since been felt across the globe in support and defense of the United States and its allies from East Asia, the Middle East, the Balkans, and the Americas. 2nd Marine Aircraft Wing has dominated land, sea, and air by providing close air support to the Marines and sailors on the ground, reimagining electronic warfare, and reinforcing air defenses and advanced aerial reconnaissance. When natural disasters occurred, 2nd Marine Aircraft Wing provided humanitarian assistance and disaster relief efforts to countries in need. Every Marine, sailor, and civilian who make up America's Air Wing will continue to write chapters in its illustrious legacy and will always remain committed to excellence. Marines, sailors, civilians, and families of 2nd Ma, this has been an historically successful and rewarding year, and we thank each and every one of you for your efforts. As we prepare for 2022, one thing is certain. We're continuing our predecessor's legacy of being the most ready when our nation is least ready. This year, you accomplished many significant and groundbreaking tasks, training events, and deployments. You built these accomplishments on the foundation of your continued flexibility, competency, and readiness. You also provided humanitarian assistance and disaster relief to the people and government of Haiti after a tragic earthquake and you did that within 96 hours of notification to deploy. You strengthened relationships with our allies and partners, flying and operating in places like Japan, Canada, Finland, Spain, Italy, Peru, and the training ranges of the continental United States. Finally, you supported multiple Marine Expeditionary Units global deployments to include supporting the evacuation of Afghanistan. Your tempo never wavered, yet today, you continue to perform, improve, and adapt to new challenges across the aviation enterprise. Behind every operation, aircraft, and mission lies our true strength, our people. Our blue-collar mentality and work ethic, coupled with this wing's strong culture and obsessive drive to win at everything we do, are hallmarks passed down from the giants who came before us. As a result of your determination and efforts, we achieved more than 80,000 flight hours, far exceeding our fiscal year requirements. We tested new aircraft platforms that will serve our Corps for years to come, like the CH-53 Kilo. Furthermore, we made significant contributions to our Corps' ability to develop new operating concepts through training events like the first F-35 Bravo operations at Bogue Field, executing concepts that support expeditionary advanced base operations. We pushed the limits in training to prepare for the next challenge in the future fight, carrying our Commandant's vision all the while focusing on operational excellence in warfighting as we have for the 80 years of our MAW's existence. The sun never sets on Second MAW, and I'm proud of all you accomplished this year and in the 79 years preceding this. We'll take a short operational pause over the holidays to close out our wing's 80th year of existence and come back ready to set the pace for Marine Corps aviation once again in 2022. Thank you. Thank you for a job well done and a year to remember and be ready to come back in 2022 for the 81st year of continued excellence. Semper Fidelis, Second Ma.